Hello friends, this is Sonia with Sonia's Shoe Boxes. I would like to invite you today to join me in unboxing this box for a 10 to 14 year old boy. I started this box at the beginning of the pandemic. I can only remember one item that's in the box. The rest I have no recollection. Uh, so why don't you join me and let's do this journey together. I lined the box with construction paper and added stickers all around the box and at the bottom of the box to give the box a sense of privacy. So let's see what's in the box. Okay, it's pretty full. So I am going to take this out first, this uh, draw prehistoric monsters together. You can see how long this has been in the box. It's pretty bent. I'm sure that it will, you know, go in, you know, take, be, be well, be, be, he'll recover. Okay, so let's put this box, let's put this row in here. Okay, since there's no rhyme or, rhyme, rhyme or reason, listen to my English, I added a box of crayons and around the crayon box, uh, he will find a wristband. I do not know who this character is. He's sort of a scary, scary in a cute sort of way. So many of you may know it's some kind of a teen movie. Uh, I thought he was cute, but he does look menacing. Look at his teeth. Dental work, dental work. Um, he will have three mash boxes. Uh, spiky little ball. Oh, another mash box. I tell you, I have no idea what's in this box. And a fifth mash box. Okay, so he is, he's got wheels. Oh, another mash box. This is a crazy video, ladies and gentlemen. I am sorry. Uh, I had listened to Christy M and she was always talking about the little gems. So there are some little gems here for him. Uh, I found this uh, at either at Walmart or at the Dollar Tree. They are flashlights. Uh, they are, they're not solar, but I think st they still work. Um, a pair of socks, a sharpener, another little gem, another bug. Oh, I don't know. I was playing. I had nothing to do, I guess. So he's going to get a, a, a long rope of paper clips, a whistle. Oh gosh, and there comes the item. A large eraser. Nothing comes out of this box. Eight pencils, they are pre-sharpened. A bar of soap, I need to place it in a uh, Ziploc bag. So I'm glad that I'm unboxing this now. Oh, marbles. I found the set of marbles at uh, Walmart or the Dollar Tree, can't remember, and ordered uh, the bags from Amazon. Then after the pandemic hit, marbles <laughs> were nowhere to be found. I don't know if you're finding them. I like to include marbles in all the boys, the, the uh, five to nine, and the 10 to 14 age group. And I'm still looking for marbles for my other boxes. Another spiky ball. This, oh, this goes with a flashlight. I have no, I, oh, I guess it's a second. I have no idea what it is, but the instructions are in the box. He will figure it out. Uh, a pair of underwear. 
and well, let's leave this one last. A notebook, a pencil case. I had to put the pencils separately because they just didn't fit. It was too too bulky. A large coloring book. I really like this one. Again, it's really decreased and. Oh, okay. It, it will come into it will come to shape. I'm sure. Three pens, red, black, and blue, and pencil tops, eraser pencil tops. This is okay. This is what I had to bind. Uh, you, might, you must be wondering what it is. Oh, there are two pencils here and a toothbrush. I can't take this out. It's like glue in there. So that is this. I was given this as a donation. I had all other another. I have other another two of this. It is a Greg Norman traveler bag. I think it would make a great uh, bag for school or for any other travels that he may have. It is a wonderful bag. I just couldn't give it away to anybody else. I, I'm, I'm not gonna use it myself. Like I said, I have, besides this one, I have two more. So I guess I have four. So it is the one that's already bound. And, and this bag. It's a mess, I am sorry. This is not how I like to, to show my items. But I just wanted to prove that in a seven quart box, plastic, uh, sterilized seven quart, we can fit this. It took me uh, four, three of the thick rubber bands. And I tell you, I guess what, it's been boxed for a year and a half and the rubber bands are still okay. Uh, now it's getting it back into the box. Uh, I'm sorry for the lengthy video. It's not a very pretty video, but I think it's packed with lots of items that this young man will enjoy. I couldn't put a shirt in, but I would then have to go into a larger box, and I'm trying to keep my boxes uh, a certain size. Uh, okay, so this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment or give me suggestions as to how I can make this particular contents of this box better.